it's your girl fabulous victoria and i am back with another video if you guys are new to this channel please be sure to subscribe please be sure to hit that notification bell as well that way you guys are also notified of when i upload all right guys so this video as you guys can tell by the title is going to be about my new puppy and i will explain everything about her let me just explain a little bit about my location and everything i'm not in my room today filming because the light just wasn't hitting in there so i'm um, filming in my intimate living room that's what me and my brother call it i don't know the light still isn't really hitting like it's supposed to but i don't know it's just a lot more light in here than it is in my room so i was like why not without further ado let me stop rambling about other things that don't make no sense and let's talk about the puppy first things first my puppy's name is dior her full name is dior fendi bishop bishop is me and my brother's last name so um fendi is just another high-end designer brand and dior is a high-end designer brand as well to get the name it really didn't take very long i knew that me and my brother wanted to name her something that's kind of like you know high-end ish type of thing so my last dog's name was beautiful so you know something that she can you know like walk around and feel proud about and then shaka was her middle name that was pretty much like a middle name of a dog that my mom had growing up and that was her dog to herself and she named it shaka so we named our dog's middle name after her dog's name so that was pretty much our last dog but this dog we knew we wanted to name her something just as you know high end and high mighty so Dior's type of dog is a Labrador mix. Now, me and my brother are speculating that she could be a Labrador slash pit bull mix. And I think that the reason that the people that gave us, gave us her did not like tell people that she was a pit bull is because, you know, usually pit bulls get like a really bad rep. And then they probably thought that nobody would want her if they told her people that she was a pit mix for me personally i have no issues with her being a pit mix because i want to be able to take her out on walks and things like that so then that way you know we can go out walking and i can get some cardio in and do some exercising without anybody approaching me so if anything her being a pit mix that makes me a little bit more happier and makes me feel like i'll be a lot more safe with her how did i get dior so pretty much I am on this app called Nextdoor and Nextdoor is pretty much an app where you can, you know, see people within your neighborhood and talk to people within your neighborhood just about anything that's going on. So I see things from people promoting their businesses on there to people promoting about pets to people promoting about, you know, used goods that they no longer want or just a heads up about things so then they can be more safe within the community. For example, they sometimes say like, hey, you know, I seen some suspicious people that were in the neighborhood. This person was looking in my window and then they'll do that. And then we also have the Ring app to do that as well. So just double duty. Well, I initially was just using that app for um, to promote my businesses. So I sell waist trainers. Um, if you guys did not know, I sell waist trainers on eBay and then I just wanted to sell them within to people in my community and I actually was successful and sold one. I also um, promote my lashes that I do on there as well. So that's what I was using it for, but lately I've been really, you know, utilizing other sources on the app as well. When I seen that, you know, they had posted a picture of Dior, well, they really posted a picture of her sister and when I seen her, I was like, oh my God, she's so cute. So... You know, I inquired a little bit more, asked my brother, and they were saying, you know, all the little things that went into it. Now, as far as pricing went, they were saying that she was 100% free, which was another reason that I really wanted her because I was like, oh my gosh, a free puppy? That's cool. I was just like, wow, she's really, really cute and she's free. That's cool. And then they were saying that they were going to charge just a small rehousing fee. Now, the rehousing fee wasn't too much either. It was only $50, and me and my brother could come up with $50 easy 
So we were like, you know, this seems way too good to be true. And I was, you know, inquiring a little bit more, hoping that I wasn't too late. I went ahead and I asked, you know, hey, is the dog still available? And then they were saying that, yes, they did still have the dog available. They had two dogs available and it was Dior as well as her sister. And that her sister was in the picture. I pretty much just asked them right away, hey, let's meet up because if I'm going to take the dog, I want the dog to, you know, at least see if it likes me and see if I like the dog too, see if we have a connection. And then from there, we can go ahead and, you know, continue the process and see if we can pay it out and everything. So they were 100% understanding of that and we met up pretty much somewhere very very local it was you know no time for the both of us to get there um, at the location and if anything at the location that they wanted to meet me up at i was already there so i was like why not let's just meet up here so we met up we you know um talked it over i was able to see dior pet her and her sister to see which one would take to me more it so happens that dior took to me and my brother a little bit more and she was a little bit more rambunctious compared to her sister. So, you know, we definitely made the decision to go ahead and get her. Now, the reasons that I wanted a dog, me and my brother, we wanted a dog was simply because, you know, we did miss our dog that we did have. And it's been about like two years now since we've not had our puppy. We did want to get us a new dog eventually because you know it does get a bit lonely here at the house and when you have like a being that you can care for it keeps you more grounded and have makes you have a little bit more promise and things so you know we definitely wanted a sense of responsibility that would keep us on our toes and keep us more like motivated to get ourselves up and do things you know so she's definitely been doing that because potty training and you know just the attention that she needs it's definitely been there to keep us like on top of things. So yeah, I know that like I travel a ton and everything like that. My brother usually doesn't really travel a ton. I'm not traveling, he will be with Dior. When he's traveling, I will be with Dior. But it's just until Dior gets old enough to kind of understand that we will be leaving the house sometimes. And you know, when we do leave the house it's okay you know the house is yours you can you know roam around as free as you want and then you can be in the backyard and roam around as free as you want as well pretty much the last question that i'm going to answer is how has dior changed um our lives so far um so the only thing is is that we've only had dior for a very very short amount of time and one thing that i will just say so far that she's done for me and my brother is she's given us both like more of a sense of purpose because like i said before um having a dog it just makes you more i just feel like having a dog in general makes you more personable it makes you more motivated to do things um, because you know you have a being to care for, especially if you're like no kids and stuff like that. I feel like whenever you have something to take care of, you now are more like, okay, now I have to go into grind mode. Now I have to like go out there and do whatever I have to do to provide for the being that I have. And then I just feel like they offer a little bit of motivation. like. If you're feeling sad or whatever, you know, your dog is right there. Your dog is going to always brighten up your day and make you more happy. So I feel like because we have Dior now, like we definitely, well, especially for me, you know, I can't really speak for my brother. I've definitely noticed a change in like my, you know, anxiety, like low key depression. I'm not going to say I have 100% depression, but I do have tons of anxiety and I've always had anxiety. Like I've always had that probably ever since I was a kid. It's definitely helped with a lot of that. And I'm just more so feeling like now I'm motivated to do a lot more stuff. I just can't wait until these chapters with Dior and just things that we can do, videos that we can film together. Already filmed a couple videos, so please be on the lookout of those. And I have a couple in mind that I have going on very, very soon. Also follow me on TikTok and Instagram so you can see like the reels and TikToks that I make with her. It's gonna be absolutely fun and I'm so excited for it. But guys, that is pretty much it for this video. 
I hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Please be sure to comment, like, and subscribe. Please be sure to follow me on all my social medias. They'll be linked in the description box down below as well as here on the screen. All right, guys, that is pretty much the end of this video. I hope that you guys enjoyed it, and I will see you guys in my next one. Bye!